Yo, YouTube, how you doing? Renaissance man here. Um, it, this video is going to address um, something that I believe will come up uh, for anybody that has one of these uh, types of radios. Um, and what I mean is that it's an old style um, analog VFO, no digital display, no channel readout, no frequency counter. It's basically old school analog. And I'm going to show you how to uh, uh, how to zero beat, and um, so that you know where you're at. Um, in two days from now, I will have a, um, a new auto tuner coming my way. Uh, so when that auto tuner gets here, I'll put it online and, uh, and shoot, um, a video with that and show you that. In the meantime, let me show you, um, something that I think would be helpful to people that have an older style radio like this. What we're going to do is we're going to go to um, we're going to go to WWV, which is the atomic clock out of Boulder, Colorado. And you'll find that at 10 megahertz. Okay. Now WWV transmits in AM, the AM mode. So I'm going to show you something that will help you to calibrate um, your receiver or your transceiver. What we're going to do is we're going to zero beat on WWV. So um, let me show you how I'm doing this. I've got WWV. I'm at 10 megahertz okay so I'm zero there on the main dial zero there on the little dial and you can see that I have the band selected WWV okay uh, a Yesu FT 101 will receive on uh, 10 megahertz so we're gonna start with the um, we're going to start in upper sideband, and then what we're listening to is we're listening to that tone, okay? You hear the difference. Okay, that's a higher pitch. That's a lower pitch. Higher, lower. So what we're going to do now is we're going to try to match these tones by switching back and forth and by turning the dial. So I'm going to show you both this and this. So we're going to go up a little bit. So you can see that tone there is getting lower. So we need to go in this direction. Okay. Now, with your ear, you should be able to hear that there's very little difference between the two tones that we just beat it on. Okay, so 
There's that tone. And you can see I'm selecting back and forth between upper and lower sideband. So those tones are the same. Now, if you look at the dial, you can see that we're off just a little bit. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab this wheel right here and we're going to turn the outer ring. Now you can see that we're on zero. And we can check it again. Okay, so that's how you that's how you zero beat. Now, um, another another thing about these radios that I've noticed is when you change bands, um, this may go off a little bit. Now you have to remember, um, there's crystals inside this radio. Um, they over time get old, they drift. So there's a lot of things in here that gets old. So you got to be on top of your calibrations. But let's go to um, let's go to like the 40 meter band, okay? And I'll show you something else that might help you. First thing we're going to do is we're going to we're going to pull up. We're going to put the radio in tune, okay? So you can see right there, I'm in tune. And what we're going to do is we're going to turn on the receiver calibrator so this is going to inject a 100 uh, kilohertz or it's going to inject a tone at 100 kilohertz on each band so you can see we're at about uh, about 96 right there so we're just going to go ahead and throw that on okay and you can zero beat to this tone as well all right so we're going to zero beat There you can. There we go. Okay, so now All right, you can see. Now, even after we went and calibrated to WWV, you can see that we're slightly off on the 40 meter band. So, we're going to go ahead If I were going to operate on the 40 meter band, then I would want to check this okay now we're going to switch on to 25 and see how we're looking there okay so you calibrate you can calibrate the receiver with using the built-in tone generator, okay? It will change, but um, I hope that helps you set up your, uh, your radio and prevents you from ripping all your hair out of your head like I did. So, uh, thanks for watching. This is Renaissance Man. How you doing?